Good morning. Happy Mother's Day. I'm going to show you. I'm going through the seed stalk and I'm going to point out viable seed from unviable in the cucumber. And this is one way that you won't waste your time planting seed that is never, never going to sprout. Right here I have a whole bunch of uh, cucumber seeds that had been fermented and rinsed and dried and this is last year's lemon apples and it looks like a ton of seed here and you'll see on some sites that tell you you know you could do a sink and float thing when they're fresh and seeds that sink are viable and seeds that float aren't well seeds that float are definitely not just rinse them away but some seeds that do sink are not viable. And how you can tell for sure is a convex or concave. If that seed is flat when it dries out and it's concave, I hope you're getting this on here, then it is not viable. Compost it, toss it aside. Don't bother planting it. If the seed is full and thick and does not give way when you squeeze it and it's concave I mean con yeah, convex then it is a viable seed and you won't waste your time or anybody else's putting these in the ground okay the question for the day is what are the most common mistakes people make and it, uh, it results in a low germination rate or failure to germinate. So that means when the seeds are planted, none sprout or very few sprout. What are some mistakes that people make? I could think of three, right, three or four right off the top of my head. But just as long as you give me a couple, that'll be great. All right. Hope you're all learning something and your gardening and your family life is going well. See, even experienced gardeners make some mistakes. This is my second round of sowing this Roman chamomile. And when I took them outside to harden them off, I fried the first round. I killed about 100 plants. But second round is doing great. Lots more sprouting going on. That's a lychee. This is my tobacco. This is a new, uh, it's called Sensations Mixed Color. So the flowers on here will have a whole bunch of different colors. I can't wait to see this. It's supposed to be a nice big variety. And here I have some uh, of the lemon apple cucumbers. I'm going to give these to my former landlord. I'm starting him some plants. I'm, re I'm really going to use him to uh, grow some different varieties. He's going to be dealing with an early moonbeam watermelon. I've grown it before, but I gave away lots of the seeds. So I'm going to have him grow that at his property so I don't have to worry about uh, the cross-pollination. New tomatoes start it. Look at these guys. These are emerald apple. These are green tomatoes. You eat them green. All right. It's Mother's Day, and I'm going to enjoy a kind of a mellow day. I'm not going to work so hard. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.